everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. So it's season 44, and this is war number 12, the last war of the season. Okay, and we're going against an alliance called Warriors Reborn. All right, last season they were Platinum 1, so they are not going to be a pushover. However, they may not take this war seriously. We'll see. You know, it's the last war. Um, and as I've seen before, these are the uh, champs that get banned quite often because they are very good attackers. All right. Um, let's uh, take a look and see what they have in store. I take path three. So let's see. All right. So we've got Adam Warlock. He is annoying, by the way. Um. I don't remember if he gets an armor up, but if he doesn't get an armor up, we'll see. We'll see. I don't know if uh, Corvus can do that fight. I've never fought um, Adam Warlock with Corvus, but I will check and see. Corvus definitely can do uh, infamous Iron Man there. All right. And let's see. Oh, now... Corvus should be able to do these two fights, but the last time I brought Corvus in for that Ant-Man future, it didn't go so well. Now, I fought him with Corvus, and it went wonderfully. But then I fought him, and it didn't go. So I, I don't know. Um, but we'll see. Corvus, maybe. Uh, for that particular fight. And of course, Corvus can do uh, Omega Sentinel. All right, so if I bring Corvus for those two, and I bring Corvus for Infamous Iron Man, then I really just need somebody for Adam Warlock. I might just bring Hercules there. Let's see. Who do we have here? Oh, interesting. And I'll bet you he's running um, the Ouchy Masteries, too. Okay. Let me see. Who's the boss? All right. Because if Photon was the boss, I was coming for. Was definitely coming for. All right. So. Let's see. Since he's probably running the Ouchies, we want a mutant who does physical damage. Let me think about that because I have some, uh, I have some mutants, but a lot of the mutants that I ranked up, they don't do um, physical. Like, um, uh, Iceman, um, Bishop, a lot of them that I've ranked up. Um, yeah, I need to, yeah, even um, Magneto. So I have to look. I may not have somebody, but if I do have uh, a good option for that Elsa, I will um, take it. Now, let's see. We've got Hulkling here. That's Root. I don't mess with the Root. Okay, and we've got her. Um, for each buff the Defender has gained. Oh. Okay. Yeah, that is a good... Um... Oh, man. That's nasty. Normally, that would be... A Valkyrie fight, but I see that this is a trap for her. That's ugly. Because when Valkyrie does a heavy attack, if I remember correctly, she loses all of her um, buffs or pierces and bulwarks and all of that. Oh, man. That's going to be a rough fight. Let's move on. Uh, let's see. So we've got Hazard Shift, Incinerate, Shock. Could bring um, 
infamous Iron Man for that doom. He can probably do that. Let's see. Hmm. Okay, we'll we'll see about that one, and let's see. I probably won't take either one of these. Yeah. Um. So it would probably have to be. Let's let's take a look down here. Hmm. Personal space regeneration. I mean, that could be a Hercules fight too, but this is a um global all of these are global oh man and they and they banned three of my good ranked up options all three of them but i didn't see titania so titania uh could be an option let's see this one Yeah, so Titania could do this one. When the attacker triggers a buff, so we don't have to worry about that. Gains a bar of power, the attacker is inflicted, okay. Yeah. Wait a minute, wait a minute. Whatever buff is in the Okay. Because I remember seeing one that if you're immune to it, they hurt you there too. Okay. But yeah, whenever a buff expires or is nullified from the opponent, 33% chance for the defender to gain unstoppable. Okay. So that should be great for uh, Titania. So I might do that. So... um. Maybe Hercules, Corvus, and Titania. That might work. And then I could take um, Wong. Although I hate fighting Wong. I sure do. Let me see. What has she got? Everflow knockdown. Yeah. Yeah. So we'll see. So Titania can do Wong. Um, but I'm going to see who I have because I'd rather take uh, this Elsa, but I may not have a good counter for it. So we'll see. Anyway, we'll be back with the fighting. All right. So I'm going in with Hulk, Corvus, and Hercules. Now, you may wonder why I have Immortal Hulk. He has a synergy with Hercules that gives Hercules um, three feats of strength starting off. Okay. So... Uh, this first fight is against Adam Warlock. And I wasn't too sure. I've fought Adam Warlock, and mainly the thing that I try to do is I try to uh, evade the special one or block it and avoid the um, our sarcophagus. Okay, that's it. So I couldn't see anything tricky about this fight. But since I'm going to be using uh, Hercules later, I wanted to get some uh, feats of strength. So as you can see here, um, he started with three. There we go. Got the intercept and the knockdown. And look at it. Just chewing him up. Just chewing him up. Had to wait that out. And bam. So he never even got to fire off a special uh they call it a stasis pod but that's it, it looked like a sarcophagus to me i don't know uh anyway pretty straightforward fight nice smooth and easy now um we're gonna get there uh you're gonna find out who i ended up having to fight you know um i was talking about do i want to fight this one or that one maybe elsa but all the ones I wanted to, to fight were already taken. So you're going to see who I ended up fighting. All right. So here we go. Pretty straightforward here. Medium, light, medium. Now, what I'm trying to do here, sort of uh, give you a little glimpse into my mind. What I'm trying to do 
uh, because I know he's going to heal in the end. I really want to finish him with a special two. But I miscalculated a little bit. Okay, you see here? Boom, boom. But not enough. So I'm like, okay, let me try to go for it with my relic. Okay, come on. We got this. We got this. Ah, not enough. I said, you know what? Screw it. Let's just go. It's not like he's going to, you know, die because he ran out of his charges. So we just kept going. Uh, without his charges, he can't crit. Okay, that's the thing. But because I run the ouchy masteries, I still hit decent. Even without that. All right. Next up, we've got Ant-Man. Now, remember I had a fight with Ant-Man. One fight went perfect. The other fight, I ended up losing. And I'm like, what is going on? So I had a different strategy here. And I had uh, looked up a little bit on Ant-Man. And that's how I knew that he regains that armor up which will, you know, glance you and everything. He has a chance to regain it if it gets removed, okay? Um, so you're going to see me do something a little bit different. So <clears throat> fighting with Corvus, you have a couple of ways to fight Corvus, a couple of different combos, all right? You have your medium light medium, but if you have a, a longer fight, you can do a medium light, medium light, okay? So what you're seeing me do here is medium light, okay? So you see I'm getting all these armor breaks. Look at this. Bam. See how it's going? Look at that. All right? We're just taking it easy, slow. He does have those uh, armors, but he has the armor breaks on. But, man, let me tell you, everything is going well here, right? Now, what I should have done instead of, and, and that was just really bad timing, but the power detonation hit right when I was going to hit my special two. So I hit the special right when it exploded, lost my power, so I ended up with a special one instead, which is not what I wanted to do. So now the fight is a little bit longer, and I'm like, okay, we need to keep, keep going, just get this going, finish it. But look, look at my health. Look at this, but we got him. Okay, it it it's it seems to be a pretty straightforward fight, but something always happens. Something always happens. Okay, but this time we got him. All right, now this fight, I'm already in that mode of um, medium light. Now with Omega Sentinel, we don't really have a problem because we can just armor break her with our parries. But you have to be careful because she has a chance to get an armor on parry, but we armor break that. And if you do um, the same attack, she'll get an armor up. So you can see here, I'm doing medium light. So we're not um, doing our uh, the same action. Medium light, medium light, medium light. Even a parry in there could do a heavy if I wanted to. All right. So that's what you see me doing here. Just medium light. And that works. That works for her. Now, sometimes I'll do a medium light medium, which I could have also done. And then parry and then heavy. And then medium light medium parry and heavy. That also would have worked. But I was already doing the medium light and I'm just like, let's just keep going. All right. So what mini did I end up taking? All right. We've got Jessica Jones there. Nobody's there. Nobody was on the other one. Hey, let's go on over here. Yeah, free ride. Free ride. Yeah. That's what's up. No fighting. Yeah. So I ended up fighting this uh, Nimrod. Now, when I was asked to do Nimrod, at first I thought he said that Zemo. Uh, and I was like, okay, you know, but Hercules, this fight, there's only one thing you have to be really careful of. All right. So watch, I'm building up my feats. Okay. This is why I brought Immortal Hulk 
because it makes this easier and faster, okay? So the more feats I have, the more powerful I am, okay? So now I'm just getting these up. Now see the falter? The falter was on him that time, right? See, falter, look at that, beautiful, okay? Now I was trying to set him up for a special two. Instead, he fired his special, so now I got to deal with that falter. But I caught it, okay? So here we go. I'm just trying to, and look, he keeps on doing that. When you don't want them to fire specials, that's when they fire their special. Look at this. Come on. But my infuriate is a taunt. All right. So here we go. We're setting him up. Bam. Caught him. That's what I was waiting for. And the fight's over. Just like that. All right, so that was all of my fights for this, our final war. Um, very, very nice and smooth run. Uh, no deaths this time. Uh, but we'll be back, and you will find out how this war ended. And we're back, and unfortunately, we lost the war, so uh, the final war of the season was a loss. Remember early in the beginning, I told you these guys were no joke, and they had finished in Platinum 1, so, you know, maybe they were going to take this war maybe less than serious. Yeah, they, they, they weren't playing, all right? So, as you can see here, um, 13 to our 39. Now, we knew that the war was a loss. And so we had a few people, you know, just try out some things. You know, we're already locked into Platinum 2. Uh, and so they just went in and wanted to try. So that uh, number is inflated. We usually uh, come in under 30. Okay. Um, but it is what it is. We should get our Platinum 2. Good luck to Warriors Reborn. Um, hopefully you guys will get Platinum 1 uh, this season as well. All right. So. That's going to do it. Take care. Hit the like button. And you all have a blessed day.